This is our editorial comment for tonight, focusing on the ministers serving under the UPND government. Most importantly, they allowed the absence to the media, despite their boss, President Hakainde Hichilema, having instructed them to make themselves available for interviews. We do recall very well that the first early days in the office, ministers, including President Hakainde Hichilema, had a smooth ride in government because theirs was simple, on the side of finger-pointing, accusing the previous administration, the PF. Somehow this was justifiable to the citizens, knowing that the UPND government was just new into office. Eighteen months into office, the majority Zambians have closed their ears on the UPND's blame game on the PF, as they feel the time has now come for President Hakainde Ichinema and his government to prove that which was promised while in the opposition. Unfortunately, President Hakainde Ichinema seemed to be a lone speaker with few other ministers, while others do not seem to be bothered in appearing to the general public. After all, they get paid every month. As such, the opposition, like in the past, have taken advantage of the media space, knowing those in power seem to have abandoned the citizens. Governance experts have accused the new Dawn ministers of saving their interests as opposed to saving the suffering Zambians. We therefore call on the UPND government to come out of their comfort zones in the name of offices and sort out the ongoing economic mess in the country. Zambians wants to hear from their ministers on how you intend to address the ongoing load shedding in the country, which was once purported to have ended, according to President Hakainde Hichilema. Ministers, PSAs, and other government officials are elected to make themselves available to the general public by providing direction on governance matters. We also call on President Hakainde Ichizema to consider firing some of his incompetent ministers who are not willing to face the general public who elected them into office. This is auditorial comment.